The word of God is alive and powerful, sharper than any two-edged sword, piercing even to the dividing asunder of the soul and the spirit and the joints and the marrow. And it is a critic of thoughts and intents of the heart. All scripture is God-breathed and is profitable for doctrine, for reproof, for correction, for instruction in righteousness, that the man of God might be mature, thoroughly furnished unto all good works. Study to show thyself a prudent to God, a workman that needeth not to be ashamed, rightly dividing the word of truth, or accurately handling the word of truth. Dear brethren, getting confirmed to the image of Christ in the polytheism of privileges is the main reason where you and I have been predestined in Christ. Eternally past, in eternity past, designed for the glory of our Lord, demands to be confirmed to the image of Christ. The doctrine of sanctification teaches that God's purpose is to make each church age believer like the humanity of Christ. Each is confirmed to the image of his Son, the glorified Lord Jesus Christ, as per Romans 8.29. God accomplishes the church age believer sanctification in three process first one positional second one experiential and third one ultimate the positional sanctification is the church age believers union with Christ accomplished by the baptism of blood God the Holy Spirit permanently identified with Christ from the moment of faith in him the Christian retroactively shares in the victory of our Lord spiritual death on the cross Romans 6 3 Colossians 2 12 a and currently shares the exalted position in heaven crowned with glory and honor Psalms 110.1, Romans 6, 4 through 5, Colossians 2, 12b, Hebrews 1, 13, 2, 9 through 11, and 10, 12. The phrase in Christ found throughout the New Testament epistles is a technical term for the church age believers. Astounding, absolutely unprecedented union with Christ, John 14, 20. The ch in Christ, each church age believer is, positional su is positionally superior to the chief to the angels, including the chief fallen angel known as Satan, Hebrews 1, 4, Four, Hebrews 1 13 through 14 Hebrews 2 9 through 11 this fact of mystery doctrine signals the defeat of Satan which is why Christ's unexpected announcement of the church just prior to the cross had such a powerful impact on the angels also union with Christ gives equal position and privilege to every church age believer eliminating any basis for prejudice antagonism or racial discrimination among Christians James 1 9 through 10 option at the moment of salvation positional sanctification defines the nature of the Christian's way of life after salvation as he walks in the newness of life of Romans 6 4 and after salvation to by walking in the spirit led by the doctrine is the new newness of life wherewith he has been designed dear brother and ponder over these things which shall continue in the next step father we are grateful for the privilege that was given to fellowship with you through the word we pray that God God the Holy Spirit will have in these things and make it a source of blessing and challenge sovereign Lord for we ask it in Christ's name father amen